my intention in creating this project was to have a performance piece that would have the same edge of your seat quality as some of you know the, the greatest of works, but where the narrative would be driven by science. The emotional center of the piece is the transformation of a boy who's going out in space, who's going to explore a black hole. And I could just sort of hear, roughly in my mind, Philip Glass's music just pounding and driving and pushing this forward. He uh, said he had a children's book he wanted to show me, which was a which was actually Icarus on the Edge of Time. And I looked at it and I said, I think this, uh, there's something here. We got the script off Brian, the first draft. We started making the film. We sent that to Philip. He sent us some music back. We changed the film. Brian changed the script. The three strands, the text, the music, and the visuals, just kind of played off of each other. Icarus heard the voice of the commander, his father, over the address system. All hands to stations. Race for emergency course diversion. We're navigating to avoid an unchartered black hole. A black hole? Cool! Instead of strapping himself in, Icarus dashed to the ship's bridge. Son, cried the commander. Get to your console. Oh, Dad, come on! The historical Icarus, a young boy through his idealism and imagination, bends a pair of wings. He flies up to the sun, and the wings melt, of course, and he crashes. That always struck me as no, that's not what it's about. You go against authority. You go against what people tell you. That's how you make great discoveries. This boy doesn't die, but he does have to deal with a new reality when he comes back. Here we go! On he went, perfectly executing a glancing trajectory as he momentarily swooped to a hair's breadth above the point of no return. The runabout performed exactly as he had calculated, easily pulling away from the black hole's edge Icarus's entire being pulsed with excitement. I did it! Let's try that again! When we wonder about the universe and we look up at the, the stars, I think that we all re-find the, the child within ourselves. If you go to this piece and know nothing about the physics, you won't leave being able to do research on the general theory of relativity, but you will leave with a sense of what goes on near a black hole by virtue of just going for a ride in a story. I, I help kids see this and leave with a renewed sense of how science is a wonderful story of adventure. Pulling away for the last time, Icarus let out a cry of victory. Ha <laughs> ha! That'll definitely be remembered!